When Miss Ollie B. Mosley was born in 1912, the average cost of living was just $400 a year, and the minimum wage was two cents an hour, and only 8% of Americans had indoor bathrooms. There's been a lot of changes in history in the 102 years that she's been on this earth. Now to put her age in perspective, she was born the year the Titanic sank. She's the same age as the state of Arizona, and President George H.W. Bush celebrates his birthday the same day Miss B celebrates hers. Feel wonderful. In fact, the day Miss B turned 102, the former president she refers to as a spring chicken only turned 90, and while he was celebrating his birthday by jumping out of a plane, Miss B settled for cake, punch, and the company of family and friends, and she graciously stopped long enough to accept the well wishes from Texas Governor Rick Perry. Congratulations as you celebrate your 102nd birthday. The Lord has been good to me and blessed me, that's all I know. <laughs> Before Miss Ollie got to the 102-year-old milestone, she worked at a chicken processing plant in Arkansas before she came to Texas to work as a receptionist at a construction company where she retired. Once her working days were over, she took to the skies. She used to be a world traveler. She's, she's been everywhere and some places twice. All of this makes up Miss Ollie's life, and her family and caregivers love to listen to her stories and spend time with her. I come in every morning, it's always, hi, hon, how are you, how's your day, you know. And on her birthday, pink was the color. We feel like pink is a color of love, and pink shows how much we love her. Not only that, pink reminds us of pink roses, and so roses, they bloom really full, and they put life into others, and that's what she does for us. Everyone that knows her has a special place for her in their heart. She is just a wonderful person. She has changed so many lives in here, and she has just really given us the power to keep moving, and she's just a positive role model, and I hope to see 103 years, and I just hope that God continue to bless her, to give her her health and her strength to make everyone smile here. We really love her. Am I your favorite? Sure. You told you. Sure, honey. Sure, I love you dearly, hon. See, look. <laughs> so what's her advice for living a long life? Well, I don't guess there's any secret. I guess the Lord has just been with me and helped me, you know. That's all I know. Just trust the Lord to help you, hon. <laughs> okay. Now we're going to talk to your daughter now, okay? Huh? We're going to talk to your daughter.